guys hello 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 it is nine o'clock in the morning and i'm going to be doing something a little different i do not have my candle lit i dropped it yesterday and it's completely gone i do have other candles i just did not get it out you know what give me a second sorry okay so of course we have my good old pumpkin spice here i collect these every single pumpkin spice I'm letting this for my spirit guide. Only he has control of my cards. Nobody else can come through without his approval. Nothing bad on me, on you, on my family, on your family. So today I'm going to try something a little different. Um, let me just see if I can get this right without dropping anything. Hold on. There we go. All right, so we have three piles of cards here. Do not mind this pile of cards. All right. Pick a card. Okay, pick a pile of cards. Um, really contemplate on it. Um, take your time. If you have to pause the video and just sit there for 15, 20 minutes, an hour, just take your time. All right. Um, we're going to start with pile one. I'm going to do the three card spread. Okay, this is um, a male figure coming through for the female. Um, the past, it was beautiful. You guys had a really good relationship. I'm seeing change. Okay, um, and now I'm seeing the woman, she wants, she wants an action. I'm thinking marriage. So, I, let me see if it changed for the better. Somebody's wanting marriage. Yeah. Yeah, look. They want the, the bonding. The holy matrimony. They want it. Somebody's thinking about marriage. <laughs> okay. Past. Present. Future. All right, now this could be on the male's part. He comes from a troubling past, <clears throat> or he has some issues he has to deal with in mentally. Okay. Um, he's been betrayed before, possibly in a past relationship. And he has a decision to make. He has a decision to um, choose the woman. See, it's a male, two women on the side, but they're the same woman. It's the same person. So he, he has to come to terms with his own mental capacity on whether this is what he wants to do. He wants it. He wants it. He's very knowledgeable, and he's okay with money-wise. He's okay. He has a job. <laughs> he wants this. He does. I wonder if he's nervous. Hold on. He's nervous financially. That's what it's about. He wants, he wants the holy union. He wants... He wants marriage, but with these two here, he's nervous. He's a provider, but he's scared when he can't provide. <clears throat> Hold up. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> he wants this. You guys are going to get married. 
Even if it leaves you guys with no money, <laughs> you guys are going to get married. Not no money, just little money. <laughs> Look at this. Cups. 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 <laughs> yeah, you guys are in love. Whoever you may be, you guys are truly in love. All right, let's go to the next one. Is this a love day, guys? <laughs> okay, you're past. You guys were in love. Somebody's been in love. Um, you guys have an action to make. And once again, you guys, somebody else wants, wants that bondage, that, um, that circle, complete circle. All right, you come from a troubling past financially. <clears throat> Excuse me. This is for the male figure here. And I feel like it's, he may be from New York. I'm just, I'm going off on a limb here. He may be from New York. Okay. Um. He definitely has, he has some actions to take. He has to take some action. And he's a very dominant person. He's very dominant. He's, he's in control at all times. He has the wheel. <laughs> he's driving. So here, I see somebody running away, a male running away from his decisions. Then I hear, have him here, that was his past, his present. He's trying to hold on. He's trying to hold on to he wants to, he wants to stand up for his decisions. He wants to try to make his decisions now. Um, I feel like back here in his past, he wasn't that stable. He was a little bit all over the place. Now he's more grounded. And now he's ready to take action. What's the action? Looks like career. But something's, something's holding him. Something's holding him mentally. He wants, he wants to move forward with his career. Possibly a loved one. I see a 6'9 here. Um, but this, with the chains on it, is showing me something mentally is holding him in bondage. Past. Could he be a water sign? I feel like... He's trying to get himself together. He's making money. I feel like something at his job. Like, they might have played him at his job. Like... Okay, for instance, I was working two jobs. One, I was making um, a, a set amount of money in two weeks. One, I was making that same amount of money in two days. The person in the, the, the one that I was making that good, good money, they said, quit that job so you could come here full time. I quit that job, and then they fired me saying I just wasn't getting it. They knew what they were doing. I feel like there was, there was some, something like that happening here.
tape. So this, I feel like his past, he was struggling for money. And because of that, it gave him, I don't want to say mental issues, but it really, it really got to him in, within his mind. And here, he just wants to be loved. He just wants to be loved. So this is for you. If you chose this and you have a boyfriend um, or a husband or a fiance, just hold him. Just hold him. Reassure him. Reassure him. He, he, he's going to be okay. You guys can do this. Because you can. You can. All right. Now, if you don't have a boyfriend... <laughs> Maybe I'll do a reading for you tomorrow. <laughs> All right. You know what? I'll do it for you today as long as my phone don't run out. All right. Okay. Money. Decisions. Money. All right. Somebody's really, really struggling right now for money. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's affecting you mentally. It's really on you. It's, it's like a burden. It's a burden right now. If you're not struggling for money, you're, you're trying to figure out how to make more. <laughs> okay. So here's nothing but action. You've taken action in the past. You've taken action in the present. And guess what? You're going to take action in the future. You're an action type of person. You struggled before in the past. But you took action. You took action. And your action gives you peace. You, you do overcome anything you really try to do. Okay. Hold on. We got an upside down one. That don't usually happen. Um, okay. So, in your past, you struggled for money. Your action wasn't great. But even though it wasn't a great action that you took, you still came out on top. Okay. You still did it. Okay. So here, once again, in the past, you, you, you got your money up. Your, your career, when I say money, I mean your career, your, whatever you're doing to try to Live to make the world go around with the money, you know. Because you can't live without money in this world. Um, you're okay with it. I see, like, fertility. I see fruitfulness. I see, um, like, 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 cheers, you know. Like, we did this. And then I see a nice, beautiful scenery. It's a little clouded. But it's still beautiful. Okay. So you guys are, you're, you're doing the right path. You're on the right path. You're doing what you're supposed to be doing. As long as you're adding action into whatever you're trying to do. Action. Which is the present. You're going to come out with, with beautiful things. Cups. Yeah. Struggling for money. So everybody's basically worried about their monies. Yeah. Money. Money. It's okay, though. All right. Whatever you're trying to succeed, as long as you put your first foot for your best foot forward, you know, um, it will happen. I'm going to try to do this for somebody that's not with anybody. And that's just in case you went through all of these. You noticed, hey, you know, I don't have a boyfriend. I don't have a husband. Um, I'm going to do you right here. Hold on. Let me just... Let them know what I'm trying to do. <laughs> if 
they're looking for love. Are they going to find it? Whether it be with a man or within themselves. You know, because maybe you're older and you don't want a man. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> Look at the first card, guys. The lovers. Okay. So, yes. I do see. All right. I see the lovers card. I see a woman. And I see a man. <laughs> I think that's clear as day, no? <laughs> um, it actually looks like somebody, the man wants this more than the woman actually does. <laughs> that's so funny. Okay, hold on. Okay. Now I see somebody that wants it, but they're like, oh, it's not for me. You know, it, it's been too long. It's just not for me. Um, I'm at peace with my everyday life, you know. I mean, I'm looking, but I'm at peace if it don't happen. But there's a man out there that feels the same way. There is. He's searching. Okay. I see somebody with good luck. Then we get the death card, which is okay, because that don't mean death. That just means a new beginning. So, okay, this person, they're not too old. I would say maybe 25 to 35, okay? This person is, he's looking for his love. The knight in shining armor. He's looking for his love. Will he find it? And you know what? His love is going to be his strength. That's a woman. His love is going to be his strength. He's very, he's very knowledgeable. And he's also helping others. Oh, yeah. See, I said he's helping others because he got two guys here. It look like older men because they have bald spots on the top. So he's, the younger male is teaching the older males. But they're helping people. They're helping people. And through him helping people, he's going to meet his love of his life, his strength. Could be you. Could be you. Okay. Let's continue. All right. Now I see another woman. Who feels like she don't feel like she has she has her sh together she does okay um and she's trying to choose who she wants it's either the red pill or the blue pill she's trying to decide I feel like she tries both of them I see him wearing red and blue and that just makes me feel like with the flowers in the back can you see the flowers in the back I just feel like she's, she tried both of them. And I think the blue, whoever this may be, I think that's who they, they end up with together. Now I see an older woman. She likes to do a lot of things for herself, like the old fashioned way. And there's a man. There is a man for you. And he likes to do things the old-fashioned way. Okay, sorry about that. My phone had ran out of space. So, okay, where were we? An older woman, an older man. I think you're going to keep it platonic. I think you're going to stay friends, like, forever. <laughs> um, yeah. I think the male has a little bit of challenges. But he's like your best friend, and he'll stay your best friend. All right, so now I'm seeing. Okay. 
I don't think this next person, whoever this may be, is actually going to find the love of their life, okay? But in another sense, they do because it's an animal. They're going to keep an animal, a pet, a dog. And, um, yeah, you may not get married, but you're definitely going to have a companion there, you know, to keep you company. Um, and we have one last card here. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, you you guys, you're you're. I breaks my heart. Okay, so you you're not gonna really find love within a man, okay? But you're gonna have family all around you that loves you. I don't know how to break this to anybody. I don't like this. Okay. Um. I do see you you having the animal. Okay, you're going to be with the animals. There will be a lot of death around you, people dying, like maybe family members, loved ones, you know, and it's going to sadden you. Don't let it break you. Don't let it break you because that, that could really be bad. You got the devil's card here upside down. Um... That can really be bad. Just a bad state of mind. So don't let it break you. You know, reach out to friends. You know, never hold anything in too long um, and bottle it up. Because a bottle under pressure explodes eventually, you know. And we don't want that to happen to you at all. So there's a lot of people out here that's about to get married or going to in the future. Um, some of you don't want it. Okay, some of you do. A lot of people have decisions to make and love those animals. They are family too, you know. They are definitely family too. So, yeah, I'm going to end this reading. And I decided to do this because I asked everybody, hey, what should we do the reading on? And everybody was naming somebody else. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to give it to them. <laughs> so I love you, babes. I will, um, I, I, I have a scheduled appointment today. Don't forget about our Hey Babes that you can find in the link. Okay. Um, below our channel. These are handmade. You can email these, me for these or these. I see why you envy me. I am a star. <laughs> So, yeah, I love you, babe, so much. I do. Have a good day. A good day. But you're probably going to get this at nighttime because for some reason my downloads have been going extremely slow. So, yeah, I'm just going to babble for a minute while I put this away. <laughs> uh, um, please don't fear. When I have my daughter with me doing readings, don't fear. She's a spiritual being. She was given me, given to me by spiritual beings, you know. It, none of this none of this would have been possible, you know, without my spirit guides. Um, and I guess I consider Kanika a spirit guide because she's always with me. Um, she's always with my ex. <laughs> but yeah, totally fine with that because, you know, I feel like they're they're giving each other strength and they're also helping others. Um, like when we did the the junior reading, he didn't realize he was dead. You could hear them conversating back and forth to each other. As I was talking, they were talking to themselves and telling him, hey, you know, this is what happened. He's like, no, it didn't happen. They're like, yes, it did. You know, so it's like, please don't fear. This is, I program everything I do just for my spirit guides, just for love and light and nothing else, you know. So please don't, don't fear, okay. I'm going to wrap these up now. And we're going to call it a day. I love you. Hold on, I almost dropped my table. <laughs>